We could have the world to ourselves Going to a place that's far Staring at the stars for hours Cause you're a renegade I could be the one who saved you from this our place We could be as one and we'll escape You having fun, buddy? Yeah. <clears throat> we think about this view. It's pretty. It's beautiful. Man, what a view! Made it here to Mexican Hat yesterday afternoon. We're at Gooseneck Campground. I got some of the. Got some footage of the sunset yesterday afternoon. This place is, this place is awesome. So we're gonna do Valley of the Gods today. And we're gonna do, probably go check Mexican Hat out. Maybe do a little hiking. Weather was great. Wasn't too windy. But uh, let's get some breakfast going. So we're here at Valley of the Gods in southern Utah and I think it's pretty self-explanatory. We've got this rock formation up here is called Seven Sailors. You can see the seven stones on the top. It's kind of cool. I'm not really sure what these other ones are called. It's hard to take it all in. What do you think, man? Pretty cool. What do you think, Jenny? The lady in the bathtub over there. There she is. She's taking a bath in the desert. Who would have thunk? Alright, we're getting towards the end of uh, Valley of the Gods. Man, this place is beautiful. 
I know I keep saying that, but it's amazing. It's awesome. Let's go over here and find the wife and see what she thinks. Found me? I found you, Jenny. Can't stop taking pictures. This place is amazing. I just can't get over it. It takes my breath away. It's hard to believe that these things are 300 million years old. And it's got a lot of color. There's a lot of green and the red. I mean, it's really, I think we picked a great time to come here. It's just awesome. I mean, look at that lady in the bath tub. Lady in the bathtub up there. It's pretty neat. All right, we're going to hit the road and keep uh, keep exploring. guys we're at Mooley Point check this out this is crazy absolutely and if you see down there that is goosenecks campground I believe right down there where we uh, where we're staying but there's a nice off-roading trail down here I need to figure out what uh, where that goes maybe check that out but uh, yeah this view is nuts Jenny what do you think this is amazing Wow I don't know what's better this is the Grand Canyon What you cooking, Jenny? Okay. We got I chicken and rice fajita bowls. Ooh, that looks good. With some chips and nice uh, dos equis to top it off. No, sorry, Corona. <laughs> How many Coronas you had? <laughs> one. Just one. <laughs> oh man, what a blast. You having a good time, Logan? Yeah. Awesome, buddy. Hey, go wash your hands off. Go wash my hair off. Yeah, what a good time, man. We're having a blast out here. Stepping on some toys. Still here at Gooseneck. It is Sunday night. We are gonna get up early and we are gonna head to Monument Valley, which is out that way um we'll probably get up early maybe like five in the morning i think sunrise is at six and head out and then we're gonna do we gotta fill up water in the crux oh uh, we took showers yesterday and today which was nice the weather's been nice and warm and we're gonna uh, yeah head down to monument valley first and then find water, hopefully around Page, and then we will head to Horseshoe Bend, and we're gonna stay the night in the north rim of the Grand Canyon, which is my favorite spot. So hopefully we can find a new, because there's a lot of there's a lot of different spots on the rim out there. So hopefully we can we can find a new spot. I've only stayed up there one night, and I loved it. But it's gonna be cool. It's supposed to be 42. Uh, tomorrow night we got a front you see these clouds we got a front coming in tonight 
and uh, yeah the north rim man I love it it's gonna be a blast a little chilly some snuggling weather everybody loves a little snuggling weather right if you do comment below if you like snuggling weather man babe that food's delicious yeah. tell us what happened last night it's pretty good Mama, I'm we still ain't filled them in on uh, what was pretty cool about last night. Want some more water, buddy? Yeah. Oh, you need some more. Yeah. Well, last night was something pretty incredible. I've been waiting for it for about two years or better. The skies were clear and it was just a little bit of moonlight. We were able to finally see the Milky Way. And for about the past two years, I've been waiting for an opportunity to take some photos of the Milky Way at night with little to no light pollution. So we're out in the middle of the desert. We got that box checked. You have to have little to no moonlight. So we almost had that box checked, but it actually worked out really good for lighting up our foreground, which you guys will see here in a little bit, I'm sure. So um, we stayed up till about midnight and the Milky Way rose right down in the southern part of the sky. Right over the river. Right over the river. And the moon was setting in just the opposite way. So it was this really cool cast of light on the canyon and on the truck and on our trailer and the Milky Way was right above it so it turned out pretty 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 sweet I'm excited to see how it turns out so I'm pretty stoked